the driver wasn't the play there. Today, we're in Mac Rahanish. This wind, by the way, has just gone crazy. 150 by 4 iron. It's a fiction right easily. Is that an OB on the left there? I ain't train that as OB. Hit the flag. This part is going to test me today, I think. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> no. Oh my god! Hi guys and welcome back to another under par golf video and also welcome back to another top 50 golf course in Scotland. As you might know already we've started a series where we're hoping to go around the entire top 50 Scottish golf courses. Today we're in Mac Rahanish in Campbelltown. I think this is number 24 and we couldn't have honestly got a better day for it. This one is actually kind of famous for its opening tee shot. They claim that it's the best opening tee shot in the world. And honestly guys, see when you see this, I don't know if you're going to be able to disagree. I've actually watched a couple of people already tee off and they've ended up in the beach because you need to go over the beach. Myself and Michael are obviously really keen to get around this top 50 golf courses, but we're going to add another wee bit, wee bit of a caveat on, on that. And we want to break 80. We're 15 handicaps and I know the chances of breaking 80 is probably pretty slim. We're really hoping that throughout this top 50 golf courses, myself and Michael would like to at least break 80 once each. I know it's going to be a bit of a hard task, but that's what we're aiming for today. Let's hope today's the day that we break 80, Mikey. Yeah, you never know. Let's just get into the video, guys. I think you're going to really like seeing this golf course. We're going to really, really enjoy playing it. But guys, no further ado, let's just get into it. Okay, guys, so we're now on arguably the best opening tee shot in the world out here at Macrahanish. Macrahanish. And it is quite daunting. We've actually, so we're going to go from the men's tees, which is the yellow tees, throughout the entire day. But for this, we're going to go from the white tees because it brings you a bit more over, obviously, the beach. It is a really, really daunting tee shot. I don't know why we're actually at these white tees. <laughs> but let's see what happens, guys. Starting off with a par four, saying 400 and 414 yards from here. First tee shot of the day, wind is right into. I'm really happy with that. Perfect, bro. I'm actually so happy with that. We actually find out the course, um, the course part is 70. So to break 80, we've got to shoot a nine over, which we've never done in our careers, but we've got to have a, a goal in mind, don't we, Stephen? Let's just get a nice tee shot out the traps here, straight over that beach. Got to aim with that first red stake. She'll play as well. Right beside you, I think. I kept that low, obviously, out the wind. Hi guys, sorry to take away from the video. Just wanted to tell you about this week's Pro Shop giveaway. So, we're out at Macrahanish, and this is what we managed to get. A Macrahanish zone towel. Which is actually really nice. Looks pretty classy, this, I must say. Black, goes with all your bags, goes with everything. Like we say, we wouldn't do a Pro Shop giveaway without getting Pro V1s, but this time, you're getting a pack of three, and they've got Macrahanish logos on them as well. So, really nice Pro V1s the best golf ball in the business. All you need to do guys is to win these things is like the video, leave a comment and make sure you're subscribed and we'll pick a winner for next week. Let's get back to the video. Right, none of us on the beach man so I'm actually really really happy with that. I'm a bit disappointed we're on the beach. I was like, you you wanted somebody to at least, you wanted at least somebody to go on the beach. The, beach aye. the wind was right into it as well so I didn't even know if I was going to carry the beach. No, I know. But I'm, really, I'm glad we went from those white tees there. Same we're right. obviously going to go from the yellow to. tees now but I just want to experience that like hitting over the beach. Really? I love I love that t-shirt, I love it's that. beautiful by the way. 220, 220. into wind. D.O.D. I think. <laughs> Hit a four iron, man. I wish I could put it under the wind. Yeah, it's my lowest lofted club, so in theory that should help me. Mate, that's went nowhere. You actually pured that thing, man. That's went about 100 yards. I'm going to go three hybrid, because I've pretty much got the exact same as Michael. 220 in. I kept her under the wind. We have probably shot on now though. We'll be alright. 94 yards, there's my distance right there. That's us guys, we just wanted to go to 194 yards in. You know something, I'm just going to aim for that, just the green. I just want the green here. I think that's slightly short man, but I'll take that by the way. <laughs> it was towards the pin. Oh, it's in the hole from here. I know, I think it's going to be like a good distance away though, it's quite short. After that though. Good <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where, big boy. So I had 220 left, 77 yards to the flag. That four iron went one... What's that four iron went? The mass isn't great. <laughs> what is that, 220 minus? Um, was it 150? 150 by four iron. 
a pitching wedge, really. You procured that thing as well. I'll try to hack it out here. 56, man, straight at it. So front edge of the green, two putt for a bogey, I'll take that for the first hole. I thought I'd walk closer than that, not gonna lie. When you said front edge, you didn't mean front edge, did you? It's almost, I'm gonna, just gonna go straight at this. That's so fucking fast, isn't it? That ain't great, is it? <laughs> it's very like that, man. I think I might need to go straight at it. Right, I'm just gonna go straight at it and hope for the best, man. Like Michael says, two putt from here, get away with a bogey, we'll be happy. That's so big as well, but that scared it. That, that scared, scared the life it. Got a fright that flag, didn't it? <laughs> that, that, that flag was scared for its life. And then I was scared for my life that it was going to go off the back end. Right, man, love to roll this in for a bogey. <laughs> Downhill, man, so it's just a wee knock here, innit? Go. What a putt, by the way. What a putt. Oh I thought I'd missed it so far, right? So did I. That was some putt, by the way. It just turned at the last second. That just came back in. I am so happy with a bogey there, oh mate. Oh my. Michael's saying that's putt of the day. It's <laughs> only been, It's only genuinely been. <laughs> First <laughs> hole. I'm not angry with that stroke at all, though. But... A wee double, a wee double to start off and a bogey for Michael, but I was straight into the wind. I think it's going to be a bit of a slog going this way. We'll hopefully the way back. We'll hopefully there'll be birdies to make up. But Pl plenty of birdies coming. Plenty of birdies coming, guys. Hey, it could be worse, <laughs> to bring us 80. I'm not angry for that hole, though, nah, at all. Neither am I, I'm mate, actually like, I like that she's an open hole. I was actually quite a bit of a challenge, so I liked it. It was, it was good. I'm quite happy how far my four iron went as well. So, second hole, par four. 377 yards. Looks pretty straight, but there is trouble just to the front of the green. There's a bun that runs right across, and there's bunkers protecting it. You can see the green up in the hill there. So I'm just going to hit a driver because it's straight into wind. It's probably going to go like 210 yards if I'm lucky, if I hit it out of the screws. So, let's see. Fine, eh? Surely. It must have got me closer than Budge because they've all just scattered. Yeah, very interesting looking hole this, but straight, which is good. Yeah, just something in the fairway here would be great. Seen it bounce? Did you? Aye, aye. Oh, perfect. So we got pressed into the dog, it bounced just there and like before right, okay. then. Hopefully that's safe up there then. I was like oh. as straight as an arrow. It went quite straight. I aimed that way and then it seemed to have went straight, but the fade always gets rid of us, see when we aim somewhere dangerous, the fade just leaves. Right, right. We're off the tee again, Michael. I think, like, is that an OB on the left there? Yeah. I ain't trying that as OB. Ah, no chance. Forget about that. Free yeah. drop out there, innit? That's got the right to be OB, does it? Nah, it's not it's OB. Straight off the tee, that. Somebody can tell me it's OB. I'm not sure I'm not playing that OB. <laughs> That's a difficulty with Lynx Golf, innit? Like, if you're playing into the wind, it's like, it's hard to know how many clubs up to take. So, we've got 170 left, that would usually be like a, a 7 iron. But I'm going to take a, a 4 high, which usually goes about 310, so. Let's see where this ends up. up. Whenever I get this thing out of the bag, all it, all it runs through my head is you're topping that, mate. It's went about 100 yards again. I'm not treating this as OB. This could be OB, but I'm not sure if it's OB. I'm not treating it as OB. It does think of literally cow manure over here, so that might be a reason why it's. Uh, this is probably just cow manure we're on. That's probably the reason it's still be. I think your ass is contributing to it, let's be honest. Right, so I'm pretty much the same as Michael, 170 yards. I'm going for hybrid. That's beautiful. Absolutely pure that hang man, it's probably short. <laughs> good third good third shot required here. After that four hybrids went literally about hundred yards. We're not really hitting greens in regulation right now. Nah. Can't expect it but with that wind. Yeah. There's actually no wind right now. <laughs> Just died, didn't it? Right, I'm not chipping, man. I'm putting from here. Definitely putting. It's a big putt, though. Stick this somewhere close, Michael, man. Tap in par would be what I'm looking for. It's all about sticking this ball in the hole. That's all it is. It's, it's so easy. Start sitting down. I hit that off like the heel or the toe of that putt. That's not where it, meant, it was meant to go, but it's turned out not too bad. We're trying to get the pace right here. Eh? Oh, 
Keep going. Keep going. Go! Oh my goodness, what a putt. What Mate. a putt, by the way. That was an unbelievable putt. Oh, we bit more, Steve, that was in. That was some putt, by the way. Bogey golf can, it won't get his breaking 80, but it would, uh, At these holes, but you would take bogeys, wouldn't you? 100%, especially into the wind. <sighs> Put it off to the right wee bit, but another bogey. I'm okay with a bogey there as well, Michael. No, we Three over after two isn't ideal, but it's not terrible I think in these wind, conditions, and I'm is just it? enjoying actually. I'm actually enjoying it. Although I'm over, it's like it's really enjoyable this to now, man. Doesn't look like very forgiving this hole, but third hole, par four again. 361 yards off the yellows. Looks really straight. Quite a lot of pop bunkers through the fairway, so hopefully we don't find any of them. Driver, it's got to be a. That is a bomb. That was perfect, man. That's going to be so far down. Right, anything similar to what Michael just done there would be fantastic. Because that was an absolute bomb, man. Oh, 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 he's back. What a strike. Hopefully that's a wee bit more left. Mine's just a bit left as well, but it looks like okay. Hopefully they'll both be fairway, man. But that's uh, took a drive down there, man, so... We're here today to enjoy this, Steve. There's nothing else. Let's get this scorecard back. It's only when you mark this down here, you guys, I can not really enjoy it that much. That's a triple. Right, Mikey, two drives went reasonably well. Struck well, so let's just, I'm just really hoping I'm safe. I was just a wee bit scared I was a little too left because it looked like a tear here we didn't it? Well, let's see who won the long drive competition. I think you won that, man. Yours literally came out Yours hit the so well, well, but well, usually I am. There you are. Right in line with each other. Oh, Who's man. won that? You might have. Mm. I've just outdone no, you. No, you've not. You've not. Like. I've just outdone No chance. Um. You've not, Mikey. Really? I think I've done you by a yard. Nah, I mean, he's had a yard, yard further. Your arse. It is. Hey, so two good drives there from me, Michael, to be honest with you. Like, we're actually safe, which is brilliant. It was a blind tee shot. So we've both got about 90 yards in. We're going to go 50. No, one's got 90, one's got 89. <laughs> He thinks he drove further than me uh -huh. because he's on the fairway and the, the angle you've got to close. What are we going for? The flag? <laughs> Who's closer to the flag? It's, close. it's funny how everyone's like, they don't know how to drive. It's uh, all about the drive. It's all about the Who are you? How to drive? The shot game's absolutely diabolical. The shot game, wait until you see this shot. <laughs> so, I mean, you can drive as far as you want, wait until you see this thing. Straight in the bunk. As if I make contact. Tell you what. If that's 56, if that's good for distance. I don't know, man. I reckon I'm probably going to be on green there, hopefully. I get a wee touch shot. We're very good golfers. <laughs> <laughs> I'd have liked to have been a bit closer, man, but we're on the green in regulation for the first time this year, so. Hey, right, get the pace right here, Stephen, we're laughing. What a putt. Sit. Sit. Oh, Stephen. What a putt, man. You're in for a putt. Putting has been good, man. That's that's a phenomenal putt. A putting has been good. But I think I mentioned it in the last video. I've got one of those putt-out mats and I've just been like consistently practicing like every couple of days, just getting my stroke down a wee bit. I'm not gonna lie, I was asking about I genuinely so hard. my heart came up my heart. See, see, I thought see. I missed it. See, I've got this kind of downhill. Just can't overdo this. Cannot overcook it. Oh, I've left that so short. Oh no. I really should be coming away from a par with this. But now I've got a cheeky, cheeky par putt. Oh my God. Oh no. This is looking hard for a bogey now, man. I was actually nervous for a bogey there, man. I was like, I can see this going to double bogey. That's three putts, man. Not ideal. I think the first putt, first putt let me down, but we'll get part at some point today. Okay, we made it onto the fourth hole. 110. Kind of slightly into wind still. Small wee par three. It's really, really nice looking par three. But that's a ball on the green now. So if you see that, that's just because we're just doing a wee thing for Instagram. But I would have taken that shot any day, so I really just hope that this goes on the green as well. I thought you would take that anyway. If not, I'll be taking that ball. I'm going to aim quite right here because the wind did do a bit there, didn't it? Oh, the wind's done nothing. Sit. That's in the bunker, 
isn't it? Oh no. One thing, right, the course is absolutely beautiful, man, but there is a reek of. Can't the time it's your breath for this course. I think it could be a bit of my, my game, my breath. One of the two. Oh, I can't even bird, man. That's the Magda Harris. I'll be behind your arse. Yeah, Magda Harris. I'm going to go 56, man. Just try and get up just onto the green. How's that went so far? Stop! Right there. Oh, that was so close to going back down the hill into that bunker, by the way. Just doing the maths. Left edge. Keep going. Right line as well. Four. I'm actually really happy with that bogey there. So what, I just don't want to three putt this. I want to two putt and get my first par of the round. Please, man. I, I really want. I, I do. I really want my first par. Could be another three putt required. Pulled it, man. This putter is going to test me today, I think. This is going to test me. Three putts, two, three putts in a row. I don't know what's going on, man. Getting regulation as well both times. I know. If that makes you feel any worse. It does. It certainly does. So here we are then, fifth hole, par four again. Tricky tee shot, pretty much blind tee shot actually. Dog legs round to the left here. Just going to try and play the driver off one of those kind of mounds in the distance there. Hopefully it fades off to the right. Wind's a big factor again here. Keep bringing that back one, please. That's fine, isn't it? 150, that's <laughs> great enough. Oh, yeah, something just like Michael. I think that is actually the, the way to go in, to be honest. So something similar to that would be nice. That could be slightly aggressive, but we'll see. That's just a lovely shop shape. We'll see. I was hoping that that would come that way, but I don't know. It could be safe. It depends what's over there, man. I've got no idea what happens left. So well, well stuck. It was stuck okay. Should be on the green. What's your thoughts so far on the course? I'm actually really, really enjoying this course. Oh, well, I'm, I'm actually thoroughly enjoying it. Like, so, although like I'm, my, my putting is atrocious at the moment, that's the thing that I'm getting frustrated about. The course is actually like it's so enjoyable. It's, it's kind of reminded me of Trump Turnberry. Very much so with like this with the views, very and similar, all that sort of stuff. Uh, vibes, but not as unforgiving in the rough so far. Well. I'm just hoping that I'm not going to experience the rough right now. Oh, this is a... I've got a bad back, oh. mate. <laughs> you know, listen, we're not trying to make excuses, but Michael's actually had a bad back for like last week, so I'm really surprised how well you've been, been playing. I've been plotting paracetamol the whole journey up there. And I actually managed to stab myself in the hand last night. I wasn't sure how that was going to be, but so, so far... If you see me string like an old old lady, yeah, that would be And why. that's not just a normal swing, sometimes string like an old lady. 140. Should we go solid pitching wedge? And see where it ends up. Hopefully, there's no, no trouble short. Oh, piss off. Oh, it just went straight, man. Right, I was actually safe, man, which I was really surprised at there. This could be something, though, so I need to chip. The green looks quite hard, by the way, to go onto. Going with 56, I've got 49 yards left. Oh, I don't really know what I'm doing here when it comes to the short game. This kind of short game, Michael. 50 yards and in, I don't really know what I'm up to. Oh, get up. Sit there. Oh no. <laughs> She's coming. That was a terrible shot. Right, I'm putting that. This is a really tricky pin position here, man. Very. I'm just going to aim up over there. Hopefully it goes back off the backstop. That's not going to work. I think I got quite an unlucky break there, man. It came, it came down quite a lot. So I'm going to put this and just get it up there, man. Somewhere next to the pin. Closer than I would have got chipping, to be honest. Right, 60 degrees, this is my fourth shot here. The idea needs to fly in the hole. I'm not going to try and be too cute, man. I just want to get up there. Go in back down here. Great shot, Michael. Oh, what, is it close or is it quite a No, it's not way? close, but it was like in a really good shot from the iron hole. A bogey save would be incredible here, wouldn't it? Mate, you've done it before today. Right edge. Half a cup outside the right. Oh. 
Michael. This would be nice, first part of the day. <laughs> oh my goodness, Ashley sank one. Par man, first part of the day and it couldn't come much better than that. Well, confidence builder. What's that a par? A four, eh? Oh, thank goodness for that, man. A great four at that. Oh, that was, that was good, that's good. Nicely done, Steve. Steve Putting in, managed to do that, so more of them, come on. Okay, sixth hole. I think it's about 290 to the green, so kind of reachable, but I don't know if I, I don't think I'd get this. I'd need a really good one to get onto the green. Let's see if I can get our par here, Michael, man. Just start getting some pars. We're currently, I think, five over. And I think we need to go, what is it, 10 over to break 80? There's some danger up there. I'm going to try and get a nice drive off here, man. I'm going to give it everything I've got, I think. That's such a good shot. Can it up, lad? 64 yards. I don't really know what to do with these anymore to be honest, only 56. Just in this kind of rough here, but sitting up which isn't too bad. 60 yards, somewhere on the green man, will do me. Fuck. Stand it. Sit. Oh no. It's so nice at the front edge of the green here. I almost did drive it. Two putt from there for a pass, Steve. Well, out there, by the way. Yeah, this would be a nice par save. Fuck. Oh, no. So far past. Oh, no more three putts, man. Oh, let's need to stick this in. Save a bogey here. If I've got any chance. Good part of that. My goodness, I normally miss them, so at least a two, I'll take a two part by the way. What hit that at all? That's such a bad part. Scared part. of it, man. Sometimes you think that when you're when it's like you're going so for you're a birthday. You're putting for a birthday or like a. You think different. You're a par, man. You think differently. I'd be furious if this went going. I'd be furious. If almost this went, that would be a travesty. Almost drove the green. You can't be not getting a par at least. Come on, man. That felt good, that par. I'm not going to lie. Ah, come on. That part out, Matt, was about to go out the window there, I think, missed. Seventh hole, I don't actually know what it does. It's like a relatively straight hole, I think. I'm just going to try and not go right here, because it looks like left is your friend. Come down, stay there. Right, well hopefully Michael's safe, I'd like to be probably slightly more left just to make sure I'm definitely safe but another quirky looking hole here isn't it, it really is. I think I've seen a flag from my tee yet. Nah, like I've got no idea where this flag is, this looks like it should be a par 5 for us, it really does. Hopefully it opens up. <laughs> I'm sick of seeing that off tee noise, hopefully that opens up. Left and right. <laughs> I'll just see the wind took mine, but this went straight that way, I think. It's it so a nice strike straight. as well. Like, it wasn't bad. You're, you're drawing it quite nicely today. Uh, unintentionally, albeit. Very unintentionally. Maybe the wind's drawn it for me. It does look quite safe up here on the left, actually. It looks quite open. Oh, oh that's my there, mate. Oh my god, that's about 50 yards. <laughs> 195. I'm just going to have a five iron straight over that hill. That's been about 100 yards, that drive. It's 50 more than we've been getting today. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> What a strike, man. A straight over that stake as well, so that should be that fine, That's eh? going to be... Ah, I'll be green. I think that'll be green. You reckon? Ah, I reckon that'll be green. My drive went 100 yards over, my five is going to go about 50. Right, left rough. Again, that has not went far at all either, because I've still got 180 yards in. I've got a wee bit of work to do. Michael's hit a screamer with the five, so I'm hoping just to do the same five iron. Oh, I caught that terrible, but it's aiming in the right direction. Hopefully that's right direction. We fair, we find that. We chip on. That felt nasty through the hands. We're still safe. Right, okay, just need to go over this mound, Michael. We're going to try a 60 degree, get it over. Are we up and down for par, man? Come on. Fuck. Another thin, man. We're thinning it to win it today, by the way. I'm going to putt that, though. Right, are we up and down? The putter would be beautiful. 
probably about 50 yards away, man. I don't want to take the putter, but let's do it. Oh, wow. Skipped up beautifully there, didn't it? Right, okay. I'll take two putt, putt from here for a bogey, quite happily. You are playing bogey golf here, well, me especially. Happy with that, I think I should have put that in. I wouldn't mind holding this for a par, Stephen, what a par save that would be. A few and far between the pars on this course, man. It is actually a really hard course, with the blind tee shots. That came in at the end as well. It did, didn't it? That was coming in way more than a, like. And for thought. bogey. Ah, and for bogey, good, good putt. I did say in the first hole, Stephen, that putt of hole was part of the day. So far it has been. That was quite the putt. If you actually look back at Unbelievable that. Unbelievable like, putt. Yeah, that was a phenomenal putt. So I don't think I get your credit deserved in that. <laughs> maybe you didn't, maybe at the time. We didn't. You feel as if you deserved a bit more credit than I that? I did, I was expecting a round of applause at least. Yeah, I just need to stick this one in Mike, okay? I have? thought it was sneaking to the right there for a second, <laughs> did, did you? Did you there? Aye, my arse clapped. My arse as well, I don't I, know I think it's going <laughs> to go round and go way past the hole. But that's good, bogey, I'll take easily take bogey there as well. Me and Michael were just saying, it is, like, when well, anybody is watching, comments, like, if you've played this course and how hard did you find it? Because we're finding it, I think it's quite difficult. It's up there from... See, if we can play at a handicap, I think we've done really well. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I really do. Like, 15 over, I think, would be... Right, so, eighth hole, it's a... 325 par 4 Another kind of dog leg to the left You just don't know how far left you're going to be safe or how far right So ideally you want to go down the middle Oh it's just like a 10 yard fairway doesn't it? Wide. It really does Which does not suit our hook or draw Hook or slice I'd follow that, I'd be happy Did you see it down? Yeah, it's up on the hill. Up on the green? Ah, it's on the green now. Perfect, man. I've got a hold of that, man. That's smoked. Oh, that felt so good. Where is it? I think it might be just off the back of the green. <laughs> <laughs> See if I'm in the fairway, mate. It's not very often that happens, is it? I think mine's just in like, a light rock. I've actually been okay with the tee today. Not horrendous. Not bad at all. I mean, that is banging in the middle of the ferry. And look how narrow it is. It's all literally right. about 15 yards wide. Okay, you're Tiger Woods, all right. 15 Chill. yards wide, Chill bro. For a we are in the middle of the ferry, to be fair, which is more than I can say for me. I'd like to just put one on the green. Ideally, if it struck well inside three, four feet. Don't go in that bunker. That was such a bad strike. Meet you back at the club, eh, man. It's an easy shot as well. There's no such thing as an easy shot in golf, Michael. I know, when you're shit. I, I really don't think there is. That kind of sounds like green. Hopefully, it's just a big green up there. Very. I'll take a putt from up there. Hopefully, I'm putting. Take, like it, take green, but two putt for party. It's your first part of the year. First part of this. Uh, 2024. <laughs> See, to be honest though, we don't play our own ball very often and no. it's like, it is, it's difficult. It's really, really difficult. But, well, oh, the green's big, yeah! Oh, look at this review. Stunning, man. Oh, wow. That's stunning. Michael's asking him, I definitely like the bunker, eh? It's as sure as it's ever been to be in the bunker. That's the, that's the difficulty of the golf putt. You had a tee shot like that, you're bagging in the middle of the fairway and then you end up 80 yards left, easy wedge shot, play it off the toe, open the face, ends up in the bunker. I'm so bad at the bunkers, man. I feel as if you're in them quite a lot as well. Like, you should I be know. good. You should be really good. <laughs> Open up the face, sit a bit lower, and flash it out, Stephen. Well out, by the way. Take that, Steve-o. Not to break your bunker on my bad back. I'm getting to the stage I feel like an old man with this bad back. <laughs> you kind of look like it with that, the way you were moving there. Right. <laughs> Right, two putt for par here would be nice. Cozy one up here. another par. Cozy one. Cozy one up, up there. Quite a long birdie putt though. I need to roll. <sighs> Give myself a look. Give myself a look. Oh, I actually feel quite confident over this one. I just steamed it past Michael. Take it away, Steve. -o. 
Oh, take over my mind. I'm this but I actually felt good over that part. Go here, that's going in. Oh. Just take that away, mate. I'll give you that. Two bogeys. Two bogeys, man. We need to we get a bit more. I didn't go around under around the back then, I think. See, more as well. We're still on track for our handicap. It's just not 80. Bro. So we made it onto halfway, onto the ninth hole, 342 yard par 4. This one has to look straight, I can see the very tip of the uh, flag. But again, it's like almost like a blind tee shot, it's got one of those wee markers that you need to hit over. But you swing slightly easier. So hard to swing easy though sometimes, isn't it? Ah, you've got to commit to it to be honest. It's, see swinging easy, it just makes your drive Ah, worse. you're right, it makes you think, overthink too much, doesn't it? Just put a normal swing on it. Just like that. That's straight over that marker, I think, so I'm happy with that. That's your that drive of the day, I would say. What a strike. Beautiful, Steve. Come on, Steve. That's very good, Mikey. Now, we didn't actually get these from the course, the food, this food. It was a lovely wee cafe, and is it tar that's Tarbit? Or Tarbert? Tarbert. Tarbert. Tarbert was lovely, man, so. Just off the boat, a wee ham shiny with Branson mm. Pickle. Mm. Stephen drink without Branson Pickle. Mm. Are you with or without Branson Pickle? That's the question. I'm definitely without. Who does Branson Pickle look more, mate? I love Branson Pickle, man. Have I done you? Nah. Uh, you did have a one yard. I had that really well, though. I know, I'm pretty well. Uh. Nah, that's true. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> don't you actually hate when somebody does that? You've mm. actually screamed a drive, and your mate that never actually drives you anyway goes the same as you, not that. I was a bit off the heel, so I was quite quite shy. So <laughs> shut up, no, you didn't. I'm raging that drive. That was the worst time of the day. I mean, that's a prime position drive, right? But you seen what happened the last time. So I'd like to redeem myself. I'm gonna pretend I'm on a practice facility. There's no pressure. Stick one here, nice and tight. Oh come on, man. It's point hitting a good drive. <laughs> it's utterly pointless. <laughs> you just snap your wrist. Like, we obviously need to get better at round the greens, and then we also need to get better at this. Like, a 90 yard shot. But watch this, I'll stuff this. I actually tried stiff one here. Don't feel sorry for me. <laughs> no, I wasn't. Looking good. Take that, man. Great shot. I'll take that. Great shot, you asshole. But I'm liking my more full wedges. Ah, you're some player. Shots. I'm some player. <laughs> <laughs> you're some player. Some player, man. Going to try and play it a wee bit safer here with a wee nine iron. Try and just chase one up to the pin. Right, come on then. Let's see one fall. The finish off the back nine strong. A par. What a putt. Oh, how's that? Don't know how that didn't side. fall. A good finish front nine with a birdie, man. Michael's literally almost had almost the exact same putt, so it's shown me a little bit. Oh, I mean, a bit firmer, that was it. Good par, though. Yeah, I'll take another par there, to be honest with you, Michael. That's the first tap in par of the day. Yeah, no, I've not had a tap in par, man. Any other par I've had probably been from 15 foot out and just slipped right round, lucky in. Which is mortifying for us to say. Which is mortifying for us today, but. You know something, our score's not looking the best, but this is so fun, like, I'm liking the wind as well, the wind's making uh, it really, really hard, but it's like, I'm quite enjoying just like how hard yeah. it is, like. It's really. a tough test for the game, isn't it? It is, it's a tough test for us uh, pros here. It's testing us now. <laughs> here, we're starting the back nine here, so on our way back, so it's going to be a wee bit different, the wind's going to be probably a lot more off the left. First par five of the day, and we've got no idea really what this does, it looks like a really narrow way through there for the fairway. We're just going to stick with driver because there's no guarantee that even when we hit a safe shot, it would go safe. Sometimes you're a higher handicapper, like naivety can sometimes pay off. I think if you're just like, okay, I've got no idea. I'm just going to hit a driver as hard as I can and hope for the best. Fortune favours the brave. Exactly. Driver wasn't the play there. I don't think, no, I don't know. You've got to guess how to drive enough on five, I don't mean, you? Yeah. Strike. I 
I've got 230 yards left. I actually ended up in a pretty good position here, actually. I could have got a lot worse. Just try and get one down near to the green. 230, going three hybrid. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh my god. Did you just see that? No way. No way. That is a sore one, Michael. Right, here we go. I'm, I'm going to punch it now, man. I need to punch it. That, actually, that made me really fucking... <laughs> that was so funny. I just thought of that fucking flopped up. <laughs> <laughs> Not how I'd really... That was actually a good line everything as well. But I just went straight up. Is that getting to get down? Down with me, I think. Oh. There we go. Right. Perfect. I'm there for we hit my fourth now though, but it's a part five, isn't it? That <laughs> you was put so much effort into it. That was it. That's the thing that's so funny about you it. You had it so hard. <laughs> I'm not aiming for that bench. <laughs> <laughs> it really didn't matter if I was aiming for that bench or not, man, because no. it was going nowhere near it. That was so funny. <laughs> like, see how it. hard I tried to hit that thing? I how know. is it possible it went straight up? Oh, mate, unreal. Right, great start to this back nine, by the way. Great start. I just need to get one on the green. Don't thin it. Actually, I need to step on here, by the way, because I'd really like to get a par here. Get down! Good shot. Finally, we're putting on this par 5. I will really be happy with a bogey here. A great putt. Happy with that. Really happy with that, actually. Good try and get a read on here, man. Love to get a birdie today. Well, that's an our birdie look. Look at that stretch. I can't actually bend down, mate. My whole body's so stiff. <laughs> what a putt. What the hell? Give it 10 seconds. How's that not going in, man? Oh, what a putt, by the way. How? That was so... What, like, I mean, that is the ultimate tap in part. Still chasing the birdie. I don't see how that wasn't dig dig I don't didn't fall in. Ninety one kept it out. Hey, right, for a bogey, for the program. This would be big for the program. Be huge. Yes. I thought that was going to lip again though. Well but done. Still, I'm a bit more confident over that size of putt now, which is good. A million percent. Because as you've probably seen from previous videos, I miss them all the time. But I've actually put a couple of them on the side there. But uh, yeah, strong putt is still definitely not my strong suit, man. But it's better when you can at least these save are your, a part. These are your strong suits. The next hole, ah, this one is nine it. five, <laughs> par three. <laughs> the one nine five, that's what it is. That should be a par four. Oh, good luck with that, man. One hundred and ninety-five yard par three, but it's literally straight into wind. So I'm going to hit a four iron and try and put it on the green. What a strike! What a strike is really. really. Not sure it's over there, but. Dangerous left, innit? We'll go and see. We'll go and see what's over there. Don't really know what I'm doing here, but we'll just see. Mikey boy. Get up. What a Sit. shot. Sit. Happy with that out there, to be honest. Really good. Mikey's we uh, open the face plate off the toe. Well, we've not actually made the green. Get the pace right, let's see one, Steve. Oh, that's a bad putt. Go. That's a really bad putt. That's, see, to be fair though, it's your first bad putt of the day. Yeah. My putt's actually been good today, to your be fair. Your putt's been phenomenal today. Can't be too hard on myself. But I'll hold this for par anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Ah, of course you will. What oh. a putt, man. What a putt. Bogey. I mean, I'd quite like to stick this in for par, man, but it wouldn't be, it wouldn't really be deserved. Not horrendous, Michael. Good putt. Not horrendous. At all. Well done. Bogey. It's been the story of my day. Bogey, 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 bogey. 12 hole, par five. Do not know what to do here. I can't see much, so I'm just going to aim straight and hope it goes straight. It's all of a sudden going really right, isn't it? It's, it just should be fine. 
Dahin, Mann. Just right in the stake, wasn't it? Try and get this par five and a two there. Yeah, let's go get an eagle. Hi, Lise. Let's go. Have we had a birthday today? No, you've had a birthday today. Oh, you've been close to birthdays, man. You've been close to a couple of birthdays, to be honest. I think MD deserves it. It's going to be definitely you today. Yeah, that one pop, man, Ali. How did that not fall in? That last, oh, that, that was for birthday. Five. Even I. Last par five. Yeah, let's go at the pages, just pick up on a thing. This thing's quick. Yeah, it's just because this thing's racking down. This thing's so quick right now. What the hell? Can you tell from the camera we're flying? Right, so we actually found the fairway with that ball there. We turn on 44 yards left into this par 5. So, we see hybrid. The pin's tucked behind that hill in the background there, so we really have got to fly over that, don't we? Strike. That wind's bringing that back in nicely. Going to be up there. Probably still be flick on, but we're still in play. Very similar shot left to Michael. 230 yards. Such a hard, this is a hard hole as well. It's like the, the green's proper hidden. We still can't even see the green. Oh, yes. I don't know if that's oh, yes or oh, no. That's oh, yes, I think. There's oh, yes. I think let's, that's let's oh, that's good. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. In the oh, hole. Yes. Oh, yes. I don't know how I've missed these two bunkers. Got a nice look here at the flag. Great approach shot from me there. Also from Steven. Steven's pin high. I'm going to go straight at it, man. Attack the pin here. Hit the flag. Come oh. back down. <laughs> pin high, second shot here. Our, our right position here, by the way. This, if there's a birdie to be had, it's probably now, isn't it? Hang on. <laughs> Is your fucking lunch coming? Well, <laughs> Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Michael's lunch is leaving his mouth. Oh, come back down. Kind of what I was wanting to do, so I can't complain too much there. This is literally impossible to get close. Yeah. Not for someone of your calibre. Hard shot. It's either going to need to go in or it's going to end up back where that buggy is. So you need to tickle over the hill, don't you? Go. Don't you dare stop on that hill. Don't you dare. <laughs> Just pick up more pace. Keep going. Oh, I'd love to stick this in for birthday, man. So I'm just going literally bogeys and birdies. That'd be all I'm after. So unlucky. Just missed the left. That's annoying. Bogey. Ah! I think it was that first putt though. That first putt. Yeah. Was. It's a tough day putt from there, right? I, mean, I, should have, I should have hold that. Right, 13th hole. Another par four. It's 353 yards. We're kind of going back into wind now though. This with the wind has been pretty brutal today, isn't it? It's hard, but I'm enjoying it, man. It's a good challenge. Right, something safe, Michael. So she's probably not going to go very far, but I think that's going to be safe. She's safe. Oh, it's not going right. Keep an eye on it. It was a laboured tee shot, oh. that. That was a laboured one. Mine was like caught off the top of the top of the, um, to the skyline. Sky mine. One thing I will say with Mac and Hannah is you need a halfway house for a bit or you warm drink. Ah, you could, man. They're missing a, they're missing a halfway house, man. They'll be, they'll be getting points chopped off for that. Those points are getting right chopped because I could, I would literally kill for a wee. Uh, wee pie oh, it's going to go down steep. Aye, wee pie bottle, and a wee coffee would be nice as well. Delicious. Aye, so if you've actually played Mac and Hannah, let us know in the comments what you've actually like, scored on this course because I would say if you've scored anything better than ten no, under, you're aye. a liar. We've got 140 left. We're up on a hill on the right hand side here. Why it's not looking very pleasant. Nice views up here though. It's absolutely stunning. Hey right, man, I'm doing one here. Just stayed so straight, man. I thought the wind was gonna bring that. Sit! Because I'm only I'm only 115, but they, like with this wind we're having to club up. So pitching wedge from 115, man. 
could be got right by the way. Oh! What? <laughs> oh, you bitch! What? It just caught the green and then it came rolling down off of the green. Oh, you're joking. Uh, <laughs> I, I, just, <laughs> I, I think it's at the top of that mountain as well, by the way. It's getting putted. Because my pitching has not been great today. Sit. Sit. What a putt, man. Take that from there, won't we? You're pretty much in for par. So I landed, I think, must have just been just on the edge because it stayed for a, wee, for a wee minute. Stuck a lot of check on it, you know, and it just came screaming back off here. <laughs> Too much. <laughs> but, see if I can put something like Michael's there. Get somewhere close. I not even making it up. Stay. She stayed on the left at least. I suppose if I want to put this quickly though, before it moves. I suppose if that was going in the hole, and then it bobbled, do you How see is that? that? It's actually hopped over the hole there. It hit something like there. What the I suppose if it was heading straight in and it bobbled it over something. It actually was. Oh, I've got a big bogey putt here now though. It's a good putt, by the way. Like, I just, I thought you were missing that. I'm feeling better over those size Aye. putts now, just after the stuff you've been saying. Right, in for par, hopefully, Steve-o. Good putt, man. That was a solid putt, Mikey. Right, this is a really straight hole. 411 yards. Should be drivable in today's conditions for me. Par four. Should really be a par three. I see a big sling. Go away, sling one. Let me see a slinger. You want me to? I don't see it. Where's that? Probably right hand side of that. I need to get back on some pars. Step on one. Who's I've got unlucky? Unlucky with a couple of holes. You have to be fair. It was heading for that big kind of divot bit, wasn't it? Yeah, that's what I was thinking as well. Hopefully, I'm just in there. Be fine. I think I should be fine. One, two, seven left to the flag. I'm gonna go pitching wedge, soft pitching wedge. That's what I get in the dance floor, man. Because if I get five pars here, we're we'll broke 80, Steve. -o. Ah, you're going, you've still got the way you're on. <laughs> so I'm like, though. Get on the green at least. Right, I'm just gonna go the same as Michael, I'm the same yardage away. A nice pitching wedge, get somewhere on the green. Sit. Back of the green. I <laughs> needed to sit a bit, I think. I like his new shoes, man. Oh. They're nice shoes, but the way he's having to walk by now. I definitely bought the wrong size shoe, guys. Right, it's all about the pace here, Stephen. Give us a, at least a chance at par, you know? Oh my goodness, what a That's a really good putt, isn't it? How's your ridiculous, your putting's been phenomenal it's today. What, see, it's actually, got it it's night good. and day compared to what it has been in the past. And I think it's just like a couple of wee pointers that uh, Roxy gave me. Aye. I've just worked on them in the house. And it just it actually is working. I'm not with three putting much. Nah, tap down for far. I'll miss this. I'd like to do what Michael done there and just get two putts here and get a par. It'd be nice. Let's get the weight right here. Right, I get up there. Oh, I'm giving myself another quick big par putt. That's a brilliant putt there, man. That was, like, I'm making par there, but it was not an easy par. Right, 15th hole, a beautiful, another beautiful, all the par threes on this one's been beautiful. But a nice par three, 156 yards. Wind coming heavy off the left, so aim left and hopefully it brings it back round. <laughs> it's just the same as me, isn't it? Shocking. 
up and down from there anyway, that'll be fine. I'll be down from there dead easy, yeah. Easy. Been doing that all day. Okay then, pitching wedge. Chase it up there, Steve. Spin up. Nice, sit. Down ball. Need this to set, I need to set. Oh, it's a bit down, isn't it? <laughs> What a shot. Set. Set. The wind just blowing it. Set. Set there. <laughs> hey! Don't you dare come in here! <laughs> Oh my goodness, that was so... <laughs> <laughs> it's come down to some paces now, isn't it? Two putt for double. This is for bogey, this. This wind, by the way, has just gone crazy. It's actually insane. I've never played wind like this. Nah, never have I. That was good, I think. What's that, a seven? <laughs> Six. Six. Oh, There's no. always a blow up somewhere though, isn't there? There always is, aye. Triple. My well, first triple of the day. There's not been a triple on the card yet, has nah. there? Right, man, this wind has just got worse. This would be a great up and down. I thought you'd done I thought it. For a there. second, I had hold it. Oh, right, come on, man. Last. Three holes? Nah, I don't like par threes, I've decided. Nah, par threes are hard, man. It's hard to plan. It would be part of any of those par threes. Yeah, 221 yard par three coming up. 221 no yard par three, too far. No chance. Right, 16th hole, another par three. Just our favourite, we're literally just saying there, we are not liking par threes today. This one's 220, it's 226 yards, which is just wild. So, I'm going to take this three hybrid off. I need to aim a good bit left. So you just get somewhere near the green man. What a shot. It should open up though. I'll up and down from there, obviously. Ah, I can really do my bouncing back with three birdies to break 80. That's a tough shot, man. What a shot. <laughs> That's literally shot of the day. That's a hard shot from there, That's man. That's phenomenal. And I flew on down slope at 52 That's degrees. But I just off the back here, so see if I can chip anything near what Michael's just done. That's phenomenal. That's a really good shot, man. <laughs> Never pitched like that. Get my first up and down of the day, do you know what I mean? I've not really up and down to anything. Oh. Phenomenal up and down, Michael, man. That was a great up and down. Oh, that felt nice. That's that a good par. Stable. That's a great par. a really good par. It's a hard par for you, man. Very. 200, I think it was just under 230 yards. Probably one of the longest par threes I've ever played. Didn't deserve a par there, let's be honest, but we, we, we got one. With that second shot, you definitely deserve one, man. Let's fucking let's get let's finish up. our buddy, Steve-o. Let's try and get a buddy between us. Yeah. Right, two holes to play. 17th hole here, we've got another par four. Beautiful par four again, man. Literally surrounded by beautiful landscape in Scotland. I think it's about 370. Going to get the big dog out, got to really step on one here. I'm going to aim on, on the OB line really, and hopefully it fades back in. That's perfect, isn't it? Perfect. Ah, oh, nice. Seventeenth man, we're both on, on oh, the fairway. I'm probably a wee bit further than you right enough, eh? Maybe a yard just Right, how far out? 80 yards. Right, let's just get this one on the green somewhere. Yeah, what about left? 70, 70 yards maybe? Could I play a wheel? 52 one. Keep it a wee bit lower. It's gonna roll. 
keep going. Two putts for fast, evil yeah. man. Hopefully home on for the bird date. The first bird of the day. Good putt. Nicely done, man. Oh, that's a really, really good roll. Beautiful putt in the heart of it, man. Right, man, what a day. I think I need a hole in one here to break 80, but it is drivable, so imagine that's what in for a hole in one. So here we are, what a day we've had today. It's got a wee bit colder on the back nine. It's just Mac McAhanish Golf Course is right up there, top three. It sets right up in the top three now for me. Right up. Right up there. It's, I'm super impressed with it. It's like, you don't I'd expect, you know it's going to be good, but you don't think it's going to be this good. Yeah. It's like super, it's such an impressive course. It reminds me of like one of the Trump courses. Tumbury and Trump International from what I've seen online. It looks just like that, like in the dunes. It's beautiful. Greens are pure, well kept, well priced. 18th hole, 300 yards, par four. Let's get a few pars at worst case here, see more. Like Michael says, last hole, 18th, it's been a really honestly phenomenal day. Really, really enjoyed it, man. So challenging this course, but really, really enjoyed like being in the wind and that, just having those like challenges. Couple of horrendous shots in there. It's always a case, but the golf in it. But it's been some okay shots as well. Let's finish off with a good hole here. It bounced proper to the right, so it came back onto like the fairway, so it's was pretty good. He's limping down the last <laughs> hole. Oh, the buggy's been taken off as well because it takes so long. <laughs> <laughs> so I broke the cuff with the buggy. My feet are absolutely in bits. And the new shoes, man. You need to break those new shoes in for a couple oh, of days before you go no. on the golf course. So I'm going to go through, I've got a wee list here, I'm going to go through. I think we've got five or six things we'd like to rate the course on. Number one, we'll start with halfway house. That's an easy one. Zero. Zero out of ten. <laughs> Zero out of ten. Coffee. Coffee, I would probably I mean, give what, a seven. What are you giving a ten though? What's a ten? A out ten, of 10 is coffee? generally seeing when a coffee strong enough. It just hits you like a ton of bricks. Ah. It's like, that's what <laughs> you you're end up shit the day. Ah, yeah. <laughs> you know you're staying up for a couple of days after that coffee. I'll give coffee an eight actually. I'm going seven. I'll go eight. Maybe seven I'll and a half then because I'm not giving that eight. <laughs> <laughs> 7.5 Scenery stroke location, I mean Out of 10, look around I think it's probably got to be like 8.5 to 9 Let's it go 9 10, let's, what's, let's go 9 What's a 10? A 10's got to be somewhere abroad yeah, Let's it? go 9 then because it has been phenomenal today It is special mate, you're right on the beach along the coastline you Yeah Beautiful hills in the background You can see Isley and Jura From where we are standing right now in terms of location, you're know, 9 out of 10 easy. Uh, Enjoyment for the average golfer, what would you say? Right, I would say it's like, obviously it's really hard. On, in today's conditions, but it's, been, it's been a really difficult see, course. Honest, it's really far, hard, but it's been ridiculously fun. Uh, it's been like, brilliant fun. I loved it. Absolutely unbelievable in terms of enjoyment. So honestly, for enjoyment, I think that has generally got to be like 8.59 as well. Let's go 8.5. We, 8 can't, we can't go too high. I think yeah. number one for me in enjoyment is Coast cool Spindy. Cool if you actually put it on that, it's so actually, forgiving. Maybe go 8. Let's go 8. Aye, okay, we'll go 8 because it's really, it really hard. You, uh, if you're you not need to not get angry. angry. You're, you you're, to you're in get, trouble. Uh, you need to not get angry at like, having bogeys and double bogeys and troubles. Speaking of trouble, I think I'm in this bunker here. <laughs> Facilities, there was nowhere to kind of loosen up. There was no nets or anything like that. There's a decent putting green that's really well maintained. Decent pro shop. I think that's a 7. And you've got a beautiful clubhouse to be fair. 7. It brings aye, it let's back. Let's go 7. We'll you, go seven. Need, you need somewhere to swing a club. 7 out of 10, aye. Exactly. Last but not least, the price. Well, we ended up paying, because we're, we're Scottish golf members, we paid £90 a head. So we were 180 for the round and then £30 for the buggy. Actually, that's quite high in, like, in so terms two, of like... £210 all in. That's two pretty people. good. For two that's people and a buggy. Easy, man. I would say that's really good for value for money. For a golf course of this, Calibre. That's a 90 point. quid, mate. That's probably about an 8.5. I'm going to go 9.5. For nine. price. It's a 9. So we'll go 9. We'll set it on a 9. 9.5. Yeah, I'm happy with so that. So overall, that's the score for this golf club. Hey, so just before the green here, I've got a wee uh, chip on. Just need to make sure I don't go in this bunker. <sighs> Let's just get somewhere close here, Michael. Give ourselves a birdie look at the end, it would be lovely.
I'll take that. Two, two, uh, two parts there for par, but we need to make a birdie in this 18, don't we? I no birdies in sight so far. Right then, Stephen's got a birdie look. Now my turn to get a birdie look. The rest, imagine we finish with two birdies after not having a birdie the full round. That'd be so good, Michael. On the 18th. What a shot. We have got two birdies. That birdie is a couple look, of birdie looks. Evo. Mine seems slightly more challenging than yourselves. Nah, you'll hold that. Oh, two birdies to finish off the round, man. I really hope that's the case. See, I'll if you get a buddy here, I'm just going to put more pressure on me to get one. Not hit it. I'll take par there all day though. Damn right. Well I'll done. take a par there. Another par to finish. Hey man, I've been practicing in the bedroom. I'm making up at like 3 and 4 o'clock in the morning, scud naked, rolling these uh, so straight. Yeah! Come on! What a fuck, man! Yes, what Stevie a fuck. boy! Good birdie, by the way, what a birdie! Come on, Some mate! Some finish, man! That we, was in for We were due a birdie there, weren't we? Aye, 100%. Well, I don't know if I was due a birdie. I'd like to get a birdie. It's not quite the same if you didn't get one. Well played, by the way. Good round, by the way. Good round. Well, that was a tough round. It's a hard round, but look at the wind. It's a very, very tough test when it comes to link golf and the wind is blowing as much as it is today. We didn't think today would be the day we broke 80, and it wasn't the day we broke 80, but golf is a real winner today, innit? What a day, what a golf course. Great company, great golf, and some not so great golf. And if you enjoyed the video, guys, there's plenty more to come. We're thinking we're going to go to Trump International next. So make sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.